uh, yeah, I went through my Instagram, my Twitter, and it was just all flooded with OBJ and Ross. But it was a, it was a good feeling to actually be compared to guys like that. They're good players. And uh, it's just always a good feeling to be able to make one handed catch in a high level game like that. Not like, I wouldn't say a sense of urgency. It's just, I feel like I got to do the most with every opportunity I get. Like, as in, every time I got to make a key block on a play or they throw me the ball, I always got the mindset that it's mine in the air and that that man's going to get blocked every time I'm blocking him for that play. It's just always being being 100% confident in myself and my abilities. After the Miami game, I felt a lot, a lot more confident in myself and my abilities and what I could do and that I could contribute to the team. But it's not like, it doesn't start with me. It's also having, giving the coaches the faith to believe in me more by executing what I do in practice. How much of that was, uh, was Coach Grisham in, in helping you kind of get to this point? Oh, he's always, he's, it's an everyday thing with Coach Grisham. It's every day he wants to see you improve. He's not going to settle. He's not going to let you get by doing the little, like doing the bare minimum. He wants you to always focus on the little things, like I said earlier in the season. But yeah, he's a, he's a great influence and a great person to look up to it also. Yeah, that was one thing that I did take into consideration is like how the receivers are developed over the years. So that's what that's the reason why Alabama and a few other schools were some of my last choices. But it all came down to Clemson feeling like it was family too, and I was most comfortable here also. Uh, really, they're all they're all pretty good DBs. They got Sean Wade, and they got number seven on the other side, big, strong, lengthy guys. But uh, yeah, it's gonna be a good matchup. Uh, yeah, it was a, a it was a they had a lot of different uh well I'll say first rounders last year they got a lot of prospects this year too but um they moved Sean Wade from safety to corner and that should be a big difference in the game but he's a great he's a great athletic guy he's gonna be a good good competition good matchup with our receivers